The motherboard is the main component of a computer where every PC component resides. The most important part of a motherboard is its chipset that connects the processor with the motherboard. So when you are buying a motherboard, you have to focus on the chipset so that your desired processor is compatible with your motherboard. The latest motherboard from Intel is the Z590 motherboard, and it is very similar to the Z490 motherboard with few differences. Both the motherboards are compatible with Intel 10th and 11th gen processors, but there are shuttle differences that can make significant differences in performance. In this video, we will find the similarities and differences so that you can decide which one you should buy. Z490 motherboard is a flagship product from Intel that supports 10th and 10th gen core processors. You can dual-channel DDR4 supporting memory slots. The maximum memory capacity is 128 GB. Both the memory armor and PCIe armor are ultra-durable. Additionally, there is an audio noise guard, thermal guard, and high-end audio capacitors. You get RBG Fusion 2.0 for lighting up the motherboard. The overclocking feature helps the motherboard deliver high-grade performance for high-end games and high-resource operations. Coming to connectivity, you get 14 USB 2.0 GEM ports, 10 USB 3.2 GEM ports, 5 GBPS, and 6 USB 3.2 GEM ports, 10 GBPS. The LAN connection has surge protection. The pre-installed IO shield makes it more durable and easier to use. The Smart Fan 5 keeps the motherboard cool. There are 5 fan connectors and 6 temperature sensors available. Z590 motherboard is an upgraded version of the Z490 motherboard. You get all the features of the Z490 motherboard, and then there is more. The main benefit is that there are dedicated PCIe Gen 4.0 support and 4 additional PCIe lanes. Moreover, there are 3 USB 3.2 Gen ports, 20 GBPS available which are absent on the Z490 motherboard. In fact, there are additional 4 USB 3.2 Gen ports, 10 GBPS available. Similarities between Z490 and Z590 both allow overclocking for better performance. Both support Wi-Fi 6 and DDR4 memory generation. Both support 10th and 11th Gen Core processors. Both have ATX, MATX, MITX as well as extended ATX form factor. Both have LGA 1200 sockets and have 3 monitor support. Both did not support the 12th Gen Core processors. Both did not support DDR5 memory generation. Differences between Z590 and Z490 motherboard. Here are the main differences that you should be aware of. Processor PCIe 4.0 The Intel Z590 chipset supports PCIe 4.0 for faster speeds. However, this is only suitable for 11th gen processors. The Z590 processor lacks support for PCIe 4.0. For this reason, it is ideal to go with Z590 with 11th generation CPU. Connectivity on the Z590 you will find many connectivity options that support USB 3.2. This can provide a high transfer rate of 20 Gbps. Even the Z490 board has a port that lets you connect it directly with the help of the S Media chip. There is also the Maple Ridge Thunderbolt 4 controller that offers additional security, 8K display support, and longer cable compatibility. CPU chipset link, the Z490 chipset has 4 lanes of DMI connectivity. You will be getting Dell on the Z590 chipset which supports 8 lanes of DMI connectivity. This will support 2M, 2 SSDs allowing you to use it with 8 PCIe 3.0 lanes. Keep in mind that the 10th gen processor supports only 4 lanes and the 8 lane is only for 11th gen processors. Memory support. Both the motherboards support frequencies of DDR4-5333. However, this will make you lose the warning with overclocking. For utilizing faster RAM, the Z590 can be an ideal consideration. The Z490 chipset supports a maximum memory frequency of DDR4-2933. This is improved on the Z590 which comes with a maximum memory frequency of DDR4-3200. Z590 and Z490 supported processors. 10th generation Intel Core i3, IFIV, ISVIN, and NNE processors. 11th generation Intel Core i3, IFIV, ISVIN, and NNE processors. Overall, the Z590 motherboard is better than the Z490 motherboard. However, unless you have extremely high resource demanding operations on your computer, you will not notice the differences in both the motherboards. However, the
The C590 motherboard has a futuristic structure with more DMI lanes and two extra USB 3.2 Gen ports, 20 Gbps. That is why it is more expensive than the Z490 motherboard. If budget is not an issue, you can go for a Z590 motherboard and an even better 690 motherboard. Otherwise, you can settle with a Z490 motherboard.